At 3.10, I got a knock on my door for my Anna and her friend. I opened up and I just saw the two girls at first. So I was in shock as to why they were at my door at 3.10. And then I saw a woman make her way up the stairs after them. And I said, she said I found them along Don Lance Avenue. And I was in shock. Um, I said, what do you mean you found them along Don Lance? She said they were by themselves. She asked me where they were supposed to be and I told her in school. At that time she said, well, that's not right. You just contact the school. And uh, right away I picked up my phone and called the school and said I have two little girls at my house and uh, they're supposed to be at school. I don't think they had taken attendance after recess. Okay. Um, after, I mean, I'm not too sure of what what they do after recess, if they do a head count or not. But I do know that Ayanna came in from recess and um, she had asked to use the washroom, dropped off her coat, and went to the bathroom. And, um, and then from the washroom, her and her friend left the school. Yeah. The, someone in the community has seen her wow. and seen the two little girls crossing the street trying to cross the street, jaywalk. How busy is Don Lands in terms of traffic? At three o'clock, it's very busy. <sighs> I'm so thankful. I am have so many emotions that are running through my head, so many what ifs, so many, like I just, I'm still just have so much anxiety over it. The past couple of days, I've been feeling so scared. They didn't have a proper protocol in place. And um, they have to work on that. And I know that they're aware that they have to work on that. Within that 25 minutes, they didn't even know that a child was missing. Yeah. They knew one little girl was missing, but they didn't know Ayanna was missing. And that was 25 minutes. In that 25 minutes, I wasn't called, and neither was the mother of the other daughter. Um, she wanted to see my cat. 